Hey, how are we doing guys? Welcome to another Will to Live Online video. This is going to be a guide on to how to get a completely free assault rifle and how to do one of the quests for Gunsmith. Let's get on with the video. Quest. So, to get the free assault rifle, you need to talk to Gunsmith, okay? So, whenever this guy gives you a quest, do it. Every time, do it. Um, I think there's either four or five quests to do in total. We're going to be doing the final one, which is going to give us the assault rifle, because all the rest are really easy. So, I'm going to talk to him, spam one. And we've got it. So, we're going to go into our quest log. Let's have a look. It's called Search for... Search of Trigger. It's super easy. Just make sure you've got some ciders. You don't need to kill anything. You, you can. Like, there'll be some stuff that you can run around. But just bring some ciders. And you can get there and get back really really quick i'm gonna get a couple more i'd suggest taking 10 to 15 it's a bit of a run like you probably won't use them all but just just to be on the safe side i'd get quite a few so after you've got your ciders we're gonna go down to the western gate the southwest gate so i'll meet you there Actually, right, so now we've exited the west gate so we're literally just gonna run south now southwest gate that's the one that you need to leave then we're just gonna run south so Basically, the place that we need to go is all the way down at the bottom end of the map, right here. It's called Fisherman's House. That's where we're going, B14-2. But if you did have a look at the map that I suggested in some of my previous videos, you'd know that there's teleports on the map. And we're going to be using a teleport which is in B5... It's either B51 or B58. It's in one of these two. I think it's right here. So, yeah, we're going to be using that teleport. That will teleport us down to... Where's that taking us? That'll take us to here, C98. And we're going to run down to the gas station. And there's another teleport here. That one will take you all the way down here to the old cemetery, like just on the outskirts of Crovo Village. So you can either run from here or run from here. It's entirely up to you, that one. I'm personally going to take the second teleport and then run down and then this way but i'm not going to show you all that running i'm only showing you this running so i can explain you know like the teleports and stuff like that and so you know where they are yourself so we're going to pop a cider because we need to stamina is now at full this is why you buy the ciders if you didn't know you buy them drink one it gives you ten thousand stamina instantly so yeah now we've run behind the mte just keep running south down towards b5 like I said, it's number B5 slash 1 or B5 slash 8. It's in one of them two locations. I've not got it marked on this character yet because I've not used it on this character yet. That's why I'm not 100% on where it is. But we'll know for you guys anyway. Really good shot on there. Love this gun. I'm actually really enjoying this miner. If anyone, any of you ever come into my streams, I know a couple of you do. Obviously, you would have seen... Um, seen me playing my mercenary lately really i really like my mercenary really good class i'm really enjoying this miner i do want to get him leveled up all right so it should be it's right there look we can see it yeah b5 slash eight so like i told you before before you go into him press m right click put a map marker down me personally i use these i'm just gonna put i'm just gonna put teleport like you could put teleport to black post uh, black post if you wanted to but i already know where it goes so i'm just gonna put teleport if you don't know where like if you're not gonna be able to remember where they all go personally i'd just say you know put put it as block post or put it as c9 slash 8. now we're gonna get attacked by a dog here Right, so this area, there is all the dogs. Just run straight left and run through the river. Oh, that was close. <laughs> I'm going to hopefully get away from it. If not, don't worry about it. Like, that dog isn't always there. Oh, he's going to bite me, bum. He's gonna bite me, bump. Nope, we've got out of range. Brilliant, awesome. <laughs> Probably should have brought some meds. You don't need to, like I said, you don't need meds for this because you don't need to fight anything. I've been through that teleport 
a lot of times and it's like I said I've only seen it outside like where you land I think that's the second time and I've been through that teleport you know a good 20-30 times easily so yeah you're trying to get down to here C107 if you're using this teleport all this road is full of elder dogs do not run down this road do not run through this side do not run through that side cross the river and then run down it's much safer like if you try running through this area at level 10 you're going to die i probably should have mentioned that before going through the teleport so if someone went through it and died to that dog i apologize but even if you did die i think it'll either put you here or in Karovo village if it's put you in Karovo village you can just come out of the back and then run down here to this teleport because there'll be dogs in the middle of the town. So just come out, run down. Yeah, and run to that spot. Alright, so I'm going to... I'm actually run too far, so I'm going to run back over. Yeah, because we want this location here. So I've, I've run a little bit too far because I was talking, but... Should be around here. Like I said, I've not been through this one on this character yet, so I've not got it marked. It might even be in number eight, like right on the edge. There it is, it's right there. All right, so where's the next teleport? I was a little bit wrong on my location. It's in a C108. Just on this right side, right there. So, map marker. Teleport. Set. And that's it. We are now all the way down at Kurobi. Kurobi. So, I'm just going to run straight south from here. And, right, so, if you go along these roads, you're going to see some dogs around here. There's a bandit camp right here, so I'm honestly run right up to the back and run along the edge. It's the safest way. We're not ready. These bandits will one two shot you. They're very strong. The dogs will kill you. Um, you could go north and then up through this part, and you should be okay. But there's some elder boars here. That's why this is 100% the safest way for a level 10. Alright, so you don't need to see this, so I'm going to edit this out. I'm just going to skip this part of the video because, like I said, there's nothing down here. You're absolutely safe. Just keep running. You will see a teleport building somewhere along this wall. Um, you will get to that later on in the game. Here, look, it's right here. Now I'm talking about it. Yeah, you can't use this. You'll be able to use it in the future. Um, so, yeah, there's just some teleports. Here, look. So we're going to go teleport. It does nothing. Like I said, this is for later on. But yeah, so I'm going to edit this bit out and I'll meet you down at Fisherman's House. Alright, so as you can see, I've made it to the Fisherman's House by sticking to the mountain all the way. You are going to see a fisherman on the dock. Um, he can take you to a new area for 500 tokens. I don't suggest going there. You want to go there, you'll, you'll be end up going there later on anyway so don't worry about that don't worry about the fisherman all we're doing is running outside the front of his house right here look near the fisherman you see this boat look underneath the underneath the seat aim at the storage box and boom there's the item you need right there easy peasy super easy just go grab that and now i'm going to show you the easiest and quickest way back it's going to cost 1500 tokens you should easily have that by now if you've been following my guides and like like doing stuff efficiently. As you can see there, I've got 16k. I haven't farmed any money or anything. I've just been doing quests. Like you've seen everything that I've done basically. If you've been following all the guides from the beginning. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna run back along this mountain until we get to E3, uh, E13 E slash eight, sorry, E13 slash eight. And then we're gonna run northeast to the guide right there. So there's nothing on the way 
It's completely safe. As long as you stick along this mountain and then go up to there, it's completely safe. You should know. You've already done it. Um, and I'll see you there, guys. Because you don't, you don't need to see me running there. So I'll see you when we get there. All right, so I've made it to the uh, the guide that was on about. As you can see, some quests have popped up because you do get quests down in this area. But we're not here for that. We're here for a free assault rifle. That's what we want. <laughs> so we're just going to run around. Um, just run around here. I'll quickly show you where the teleports are, actually, because there's two uh, teleports. We're currently at the storage. There's a teleport to the shop and a teleport back to the storage. Oh. I am low health. Go away. <laughs> Alright, so we're around here, and this is the storage for Grove Village. Now, if you want to teleport to the shop, you know, like, I need a med kit, so I'm going to grab one real quick. The right side, there's a bush here, go in it. Boom. You're in the shop area, right across town. So I'm going to grab this in a med kit, and I'll show you where the teleport is. Hello yourself, just going to spam through that. You do have to talk to me first time you get here. That's actually the mysterious buyer quest as well, if you haven't done that yet. So, we've actually just done two quests in one, because we're awesome. Got on there. Alright, so after you come out of the shop, go left. Go left again. This bush here. Boom. You're back at the storage. So, the quickest way back to the main town. This guy here. Talk to him. And you want to go to the bog. <laughs> that sounded weird. The bog area is called, it's the swamp, but for some reason they call it the bog. It's 1,500 tokens, that'll take you straight up into this map that you've probably not been to before. This is the swamp. So, you're going to turn instantly around, go back south. And we're just going to run out of this area right here. Now, we are back into the main map. And we are very close to the main town. So if we press M on the map, as you can see, the main town is right there. So that's where the swamp entrance is. It's right there. But look how much time that's just saved us. Instead of running all the way back up here, we literally just paid one and a half K, teleported to here, and now we've just got to run down to there. And that's it. Quest is basically done. Now you've just got to hand it in. So yeah, that's the quest done. All you need to do is hand it in. I could have just shown the location, but for a lot of people that are going to be watching this, they're not going to know about all these teleports and all these fast ways to get around. It's really helpful. And... You know, like I told everyone at the start, if you wanted to know where, just where the location were, timestamp, you know what I mean? Description. There's always a timestamp in the description. So, I'm going to skip this run. Like I so said, you don't need to see me doing this. You've been up here. You know this area. So, I'm going to meet you at the shop, and we're going to have a look at our new, completely free assault rifle. Alright, so we're back here. Alright, so we're back in the main town. I'm going to hand my quest in and get my free assault rifle. We're running into here, straight to the gunsmith. Press F. Spam 1. There you go. Oh, sorry. Press F. Spam 1. There you go. Because you helped him out. Now press I. <laughs> I was like, oh, I, I, I was honestly like, where's my gun? <laughs> but there it is. <clears throat> sorry about that. I'm going to drag this over onto number 4. And there is our completely free level 10 assault rifle. It's not the greatest gun in the world, but it is good for a level 10. It is very good for a level 10. And it's completely free, and it's valued at 8k. So, if I wanted to sell this, I wouldn't get 8k for it. I would get 5,600. So, it's good money or a good gun. But, yeah, that's how you do it, guys. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you liked it. If you did, make sure to give the video a like. Also, make sure to subscribe for future videos. If you have any suggestions or you just want to say thanks or anything like that, make sure to leave a comment. And also you can check the description below for links to my Discord where my community is for the YouTube channel and also a link to my Twitch channel where I stream games every single night. I hope you enjoyed the video guys, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.